guys. Hold it. Oh, I love you. Thanks. Okay. Let's show them everything we're gonna do. Well, he's gonna do today. Oh, you got, we gotta show them the hardwood floor that we installed in the living room. Mm, yeah. So. Baby room, it's all done. No, this is gonna be baby girl's room. And as you can see, there's the stupid doorway and stupid trim. How there's bumps all over the walls. Stupid trim. So. What are you gonna do, Josh? Tear it all out. Tear all the drywall out. Tear all the trim out. And then put up, and then we're gonna tear out the carpet and padding. So everything in here is gonna be brand spanking new. Here's a before. And then he's gonna hopefully record as I'm gone. Show the process. Oh, it's so hot. I'm just dripping. That's what I got so far. It's, it's so old. It's like mortar. It's like, I don't know what it is, but some guy told me at the store that it has horse hair in it. And I wasn't, I didn't believe him. I don't know if you can see it. Where's it at? Right here full of hair. That's what the whole wall's made of. So yeah, it's gonna be lovely. Let's just sit here and pick at the whole wall held together by horse hair. Well, check in in a little bit. tore out all the drywall which the drywall was like had horse hair in it right horse hair yeah horse hair and then this is three the floor, floor now is carpet on top of carpet on top of this floor and then there is that big old beehive in the wall as well but yeah this is the walls all right, honey, tell everyone what you've been working on. The baby room. <laughs> I know, well, what, what have you done so far? Well, I insulated these walls. First, you had to put that stuff up. The breathable barrier, so it won't moisture. And then you put all insulation in by hand. Shoved it in all of them. And I put the drywall over that, got all the outlets ran. Yeah, you can see he already has drywall up right there. Yeah. And then we have more drywall here. I will have it all drywalled in today. Yeah, you must get a lot done. So what I got so far, I got that wall done and that wall done. And let me tell you, it sucks doing around these windows. All I got left is that one and that one. Those should go a little easier since there's no windows. Got the hard ones done first. It has been a nightmare. Oh, and I insulated both them walls. That wall and that wall. I only insulated the outer walls. I told Audrey that we should insulate this wall so it kind of soundproofs it so they won't sound so hollow. Especially when we have a couple kids. We need it insulated so we can't hear them. Oh well, yeah, that's what I got so far. showed you the baby room after he put all the drywall up so I'm gonna do that since he ran downstairs real fast and after I show you this we're gonna be mudding the baby room next so I'll show you what it looks like now so there's the door and then it's all drywall now but this used to be a doorway 
that led into the other bedroom, which was stupid and it was blocked off in a weird way. But yes, this is now what it is looking like. And I love it so much better. All right, today is now day two. Well, it's been like plenty of dates. But the second day in the row that it's just cranky. Second day in the row that we're actually doing something. More mudding, but we're right now we're doing the the seams. Right? Yes. The seams. Joy's helping us. He just had a vet appointment today. And he has to get his teeth cleaned and he's pulled. So he's not very happy. Anyways, we are now putting the seams up. As you can see, we already did this wall and this wall, and that's what it looked like before and after the seams get up. So you can see the difference from what we have done. So it's almost done. And then my mom and I picked out the pink colors today, which I will show you another time. Once it gets closer to actually painting, I'll show you the colors and what we plan on doing with how we're gonna paint this room. So Joey, you sit there, lay down, be good boy. All right, it is a couple days later. The walls are all ready to be painted. I got my mom here. So we're gonna prime and paint and I'll do like a montage of us priming and painting so you can see the progress of the room. But this is what it's looking like right now. painting the ceiling as you can see but the walls are primed now we just gotta pick out pink colors because these colors we don't know but right now I am painting the ceiling and that's not gonna stay either we're getting a different light fixture and I just love painting ceilings I left a mess but we finally found a paint color that we like we found our pink and we found our gray third time of the charm We've gone through, this is our third pink and our third gray. And we found the ones that we like and what will work for the room. And then we're adding some glitter to the paint or some shimmer to, to add some shimmer to the walls, whatever. So now we're gonna paint this wall pink and the rest of the four walls above and then the rest of the wall is gray. Because it's going to be a pink wall with gold stars. So that's what we're going to do. We have finished painting the rooms, well, the bedroom, and this is what the star wall looks like. Oh my gosh. And then it's just gray walls, a very light gray on the rest of the walls. But in the paint, I've said that it's the, we added glitter into the paint and there's glitter in the stars as well. But 
I might have to show you guys another time if I can do that when the room's done. And now we're doing trim for the windows and then the floor and then the door. So we got the trim ready. And then after the trim, we get the carpet. So that's what he's gonna be doing right now is the window trim. All right, there you go. You can kind of see the sparkles in the walls. I'm trying my best to show you guys, but the lighting isn't gonna really work for me right now. But as you can see, there's glitter in the walls. And I thought we had enough padding from when we did the living room. And <laughs> we don't. So this is what the padding looks like. We, it doesn't even cover half the room. So we have to get padding and I thought we would have had enough because it looked like a lot when it was rolled up. But when we unrolled it, half, done half of it, I know. When we unrolled it, it didn't even touch half the room at all. So now we just gotta get carpet and padding. So here's the before and then I'll show you the after uh, once the trim is up. How'd you do, honey? Huh? How'd you do? Good. It looks so good. I like it. And here is the after of what wow. it is now. No close-ups. Nope. So it looks so much better as you could see the difference from what it was and now with trim on it. You did good, honey. I'm proud of you. So this is like before and then after. Woohoo! You did good, babe. Yeah. All right, today is the day. <sighs> I look ridiculous, but today is the day we finally get carpet. So this is before that padding's being taken out because we got the actual padding. So this is before, and this is the wall finished. And then we got the curtains. I put them in here, so they don't get wrecked when they're putting the carpet in. But this is what they look like. They have like shiny sparkly things on here and it goes perfect with her room. And I got these at Walmart. So now we're just gonna put the carpet in and I'll be ready to put everything in there. I'm so excited. <sighs> now I'm out of breath. So yes. Before and after. So I hung the curtains back up. We got the dresser in here now. The wall, her mirror, her first piggy bank. All we got left to do is the floor trim and the room is finished. And then I will be doing a nursery tour once it's all decorated, but this um, video was just of us re like tearing everything apart and redoing the whole room. So I hope you guys enjoyed this room transformation of what the ugliness was to what it is now. I love that wall. I love it. To what it is now. Oh, I'm so excited. Can't wait to get everything in here. But yes. I'm happy it's finally finished. Just got, we're gonna do the, I think he's gonna do like the floor trim today or something. I know we're setting the crib up today. So I'm excited for that. Oh, I'm so excited that it's done and getting put together. I'm so excited that it's done and getting put together. And I just love the freaking curtains in here, love them. I just gotta get blackout um, roller curtains for behind there. Or blinds were behind there. So I hope you guys enjoyed this room. What would you call this? Like room transformation. Oh, and next I will be doing, once this is completely done, a room, a baby nursery tour once it's done. But that probably won't be till after Christmas because I gotta wait for one thing and that'll be after Christmas. So that video won't be up till after Christmas, if not before. I can't make promises. 
What do you think, Joey? You like it? No going potty in here, you hear me? And then we gotta spray paint that vent because it's so disgusting looking. Josh has to sand it and spray paint it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully it's not all over, all over the place, but it probably is. But you guys to see the room transform into what it is now. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.